Hi there, welcome back to DM Keith Skoda in Wakefield. Today I'm going to be showing you around this fantastic Skoda Octavia SEL First Edition. This has just come into our site now. Uh, it's a fantastic looking car in this lovely moon white, as you can see. I'm going to show you around it now, show you some of the features. We'll start off with the 17 inch alloy wheels in great condition, very well looked after, and the tyres are in great condition as well. Plenty of tread left. Very nice style on these tyres, they really suit the car well. You can see we've got chrome window surrounds and tinted rear windows there as well. Very nice looking. It's a very classy looking car this, very professional. As we move around to the back, Delta Golf 21, Uniform Romeo Mike is the registration. And if I show you in the boot, as usual with these, it's a manual boot. As usual with these, it is very, very spacious in here. You've always got storage pockets either side. You've got levers to lower the seats from here. You've got the shopping hooks on either side as well. And of course, a spare wheel beneath the floor there too. Very, very practical. Now onto those rear seats. You can see we've got keyless entry and keyless lock on all four doors and boot. And inside you've got lovely black half leather in great condition with ice fix covers on left and right hand side. Got lovely carpets as well. Two USB-C ports down here. You've got three headrests and a lovely armrest divider as well. It also has a ski hatch and two unexposed cup holders and a pen holder, which is very nice. There's even a slot to hold your phone in there. So you can watch it on the back there in the back pocket, which is very handy. The car has done 10,961 miles, which for a 1.5 litre petrol manual is very low considering it's a 21 plate. Then up front, you'll see we've got the daytime running lights, the normal lights on as well, and there's corner fog lights too. Then stepping inside, you can see we've got, as mentioned, 10,961 miles, and you've got the virtual cockpit there as well. Please ignore that, that is saying that there is uh, no washer fluid and the tyres need looking at, just for air, not an issue. Uh, we've got obviously volume and song selection controls and voice control, you've got controls for the screen in the center. Oh, if it wants to work. Oh, that's bear with, the door is open. There we are with the door closed now. You can see we can cycle through all the centers of the virtual cockpit. You've got dynamic cruise control down here or adaptive cruise control, indicators and wipers there. Lights with front and rear fogs as mentioned, extra storage here where the keys are currently being held. Got keyless go as well as keyless entry. Uh, all electric window and mirror adjustment, including electronic folding and heating. On the infotainment, so as you can see, we've got front and rear parking sensors there. We have drive modes. We also have climate control con um, access through this button here. So you press this button and it brings up where you want it directing and what temperature and fan speed and such. You've even got heated front seats as well. There is, of course, satellite navigation as I showed on the virtual cockpit. There is Apple CarPlay and Android Auto connectivity, Bluetooth connectivity for phone and music and there is obviously vehicle settings there as well and assistance systems there so you've got lane assist forward warning blind spot monitoring and uh, that is the adaptive cruise control thing there you've got maximum demist at the front rear demist climate control button lock and unlock hazards and then this one if you press set is how you can set the stop start on or off interior monitoring and reset the tire pressures as well as traction control very easy underneath here you've got a large spot for your phone with two more usb-c ports Six speed manual will be just behind that, goes through all the gears very smoothly and down and across and up into reverse, which automatically engages the rear sensors. Electronic handbrake with auto hold function, as well as two hideable cup holders here as well. Beneath here you have extra storage under the armrest, which does double as an armrest, so you can have it there any distance you like. In here you've got the owner's manual, air conditioned glove box, and there's the lug nut in there as well. Up here you've got the SOS button, you've got the lights which are touch sensitive, which is a very nice feature, and of course, your sunglasses holder. So all in all, oh, and I forgot to mention as well, you've got the half leather seats as well up front with ice fix points on the front passenger seat as well. So all in all, a great car. This obviously being a first edition, it's well specced. If you are interested, please do feel free to visit us at Denverdale Road, Wakefield, WF27AW, or alternatively, give us a call on 01924 246900. Thank you very much for your time. You take care now.